Hello everyone, what's up? It's Savannah and today we are checking out Moonglow Bay. I'm very excited about this. The developer was kind enough to send me a code, which I very much appreciate. And if you know anything about me, I love fishing mechanics and games. I don't know why, it's something I just absolutely adore. And this game actually focuses on fishing, so I'm very excited to get into it. So let's just go ahead and check it out. Okay. See, okay. Where am I? Savannah, come on, you guppy. Grab the line. Fishing is easier than it looks, I promise. What are you afraid of? Oh. Nothing, except for the water, the monsters, the curse, you know, what the locals say. They're just stories. Every one of them, I promise. Here, let me show you the basics. Follow along with me. First, stand in a decent fishing spot, like at the edge of the boat, right here. Then, select the fish and hook icon to begin. Um, oh, I'm going, okay. Ooh. Now to cast the line. Fish will be more cautious if you cast near your boat or the shore. The further you cast, the more likely something will bite. Mm. Press and hold spacebar to cast your line. The longer you hold, the greater the distance. Okay. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Now be patient. Keep the lure still and wait for something to bite. Mm -hmm. The moment the lure dips... Press and hold space to hook the fish. Be quick or it might escape. Press and hold, okay. Once hooked, continue holding to reel it in. Okay. When's it gonna happen? Oh! How do I know? Oh, that's how I know. Fish will change direction as they try to break free. Move A in the opposite direction. Oh, okay, cool. What? I'm so confused. Oh. Okay. This is a very interesting mechanic. Okay. Very interesting mechanic. Grating bellyfish. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> See? Easy when you get the hang. Give it another go, this time without my help. Oh, God. Okay. Let's see how this goes. The directional thing is a little interesting to me. Ooh. So I have to go, like, the opposite of how they're going, I guess? Come here, you whippersnapper. Come here! Come here! Oh my lord and mercy! Okay, oh girl! Get in here! Get in here! Come here! I said come here! Ooh, girl! Damn, okay, we're gonna keep you because we're fishermen gonna eat you. Oh. Fantastic. And a different species. We'll need a variety to cook and sell for our new business. Damn, we're entrepreneurs? Oh. Oh, the dog in the boat! What is it, a pirate? What the? <laughs> what is that? It's the monster! The curse! Come to torment us! Ah! It's just a whale. Oh, this town's ridiculous superstitions. No wonder the fishing trade is ruined. Hmm. But the bay is full of amazing creatures. All wait all waiting to be discovered. We'll find them and share them with the world. <laughs> On that note, here, to celebrate our new adventure. <laughs> hey, what happened to No More Surprises? Feels like a book. I'll open it tomorrow night once you're back. He doesn't come back. He's lost at sea. You still want this, right? We could always go back to Ontario. <laughs> We're Canadian? Of course. Moving here, it's your dream. 
But I'm asking what you want. What's your dream? Mm -hmm. My dream hasn't changed in 40 years to spend every day with you. Oh. Mm. Oh. Then I'll be right here, the whole journey by your side. Welcome home. Oh, oh, they're kissing. Blech. I'm kidding. I feel like a freaking five-year-old. Sorry, my bad. Who's Slay? Look at that. That's cute. Oh, also, if you guys don't know, this is available on Switch. And I think a couple other platforms, too. Oh, no. He did go missing at sea. Oh, girl. At least you have your dog. I'm just here for the dog and the fishing, to be honest with you. Girl, that's definitely- I've played too many horror games. I'm like, that's definitely an intruder. I don't trust it. Oh, this is so cool. I'm coming. Oh, can I pet you? Can I pet that dog? You know, I had never actually seen the original of Can I Pet That Dog? And then I realized it was a kid talking about a bear. Hey, Mom. River? Why aren't you in Quebec? Mm. I gave my notice. Some things are more important. I'm a mother? Don't be judging my house. Is this it? Mm. Presumption of the aforementioned believed to be dead owing to an absence of no less than three years. Wow, it's also real. It's great you're here, but I'm fine, honestly. Mm. Actually, I got a new job. I'm overseeing the Centennial Festival. Mm. You're doing what? Here? In Monglo? Ah. The mayor says it'll be a huge boost for the community. Mm. People need the support. The whole bay has been struggling for years. Mm. When the fishing trade collapsed, half the town closed down. Oh. If we can't attract new visitors soon, Monglo Bay might never recover. Ah. Anyway, on to brighter things. It's time to open that present. You got me a gift, honey? Where is it? Uh. Hey, Mom, why'd you call the dog Waffles? Because why not? Wait, let me guess. Because of how much Taylor loved Waffles? Huh. But not as much as me. Remember, every Saturday, right after swimming, maple, maple syrup, cinnamon, huh. strawberries, glass of milk. Ah, oh, those were the good times. Uh, sorry, what were you saying? I wasn't. Where's my gift? Can I pet that down? Where's the gift? Oh. A fishing journal? To my darling Savannah. For the journey by your side. You've been holding onto this for three years, Mom. Maybe it's time to write a new chapter. You're saying I should restart the business? Oh. Precisely! A new street food stall is exactly what this town oh. needs. You would be an inspiration. We should head out right now, catch some ingredients. Huh. Okay, okay, but let me tidy first. If I'd known you were coming. Oh. And ruin the surprise? <laughs> okay, I'll be down on the beach. Hi Taylor, it's been three years. Some days are a little easier. Others are impossible. Last week a letter arrived declaring you dead in absentia. So naturally our daughter dropped everything to come here. Thank you for my journal. I'll treasure it always and write to you often. <laughs> Stop. This is cool. I like this, um, this journal. This is pretty nice. The, I have to say, though, the, um, controls here are a little strange. Equipment. Girl, where am I even? I still have these fish from three years ago. What is this? Okay. I gotta open the journal. What am I doing with the journal? I don't understand. Meet River of Beach, tidy up the noodle pack. Okay, I gotta tidy I gotta tidy up these noodle packets. My bad. Let me just <sighs> spick and span. I keep going to grab my um 
keyboard. Or my mouse. I'm used to games where you use your mouse, whereas with this, it's exclusively um, keyboard. Which is a little strange for me, and I don't know why. My brain just doesn't... Look at the freaking penguin up top, sorry. My brain just doesn't want to wrap its head, mind, what am I saying? I can't talk today. It's early, okay? I woke up like an hour ago. I'm making excuses. <laughs> okay, that's the last of it. The trash can's outside since you clearly forgot, Fisher. Good boy, you're such a good boy. Waffles. I love you. How old is this dog? This dog better live forever. Oh my god. Oh, raccoon! Oh, this is cute. Love that. Okay. Ooh, the little map. I'm like covering it, but there's like a map for me. Uh oh. <sighs> oh, this is so cute. I actually really like this art style. Huh? You were right. The st streets are so empty I barely noticed before. The town needs investment. Pure and simple, but at least you have everything you need for your business. Mm. Your fishing rod, your kitchen, and a place to sell food. Huh. First things first, let's catch some ingredients. Okay. Here we go. Let's see how we do today. It does weird me out how I still have the same. When reeling, you can use a quick burst of effort to haul the fish in a particular direction. This technique is called striking. The strike, move A against the direction of the fish, is swimming, and then press shift. Okay. Just don't strike too often or you'll tire yourself out. Yeah. What? I wasn't even given an option. How do I know if I'm like... Come here! Come here. Oh, I did it! New species, Ling. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's light on actual information. I'm an accountant, not a blummin' marine biologist. Oh, this is so cool. Huh. Huh, I'm sure the aquarium can help fill in the details. I love this. Okay, wait, stop. So one of my favorite things about Animal Crossing is the museum aspect. It's one of my favorite things to do. So the fact that this has, like, that sort of element to it, Love that. Huh. Since we're here, let's recap water behavior and luring. Mm. When reeling a fish, it will behave in one of three ways depending on its species. Fast species will dart around quickly to wriggle free. Reflexes are key. Aggressive species will use a combination of speed and strength to escape. Oh. Finally, resilient species are slow moving but strong. It'll take several powerful strikes to haul one in. Mm -hmm. Fortunately, you can attract specific fish by using lures. <gasps> Give it a go. Select a lure and cast your line. How do I pick a lure? Hello? Um. How do I do that? A spinner? A jig? Um. How do I do that? I missed the memo! Hello? What is this? Oh. oh! Okay. The jig lure will attract aggressive and resilient fish. Huh. The spinner lure will attract fast and aggressive mm. fish. Finally, the plug lure will attract resilient and fast fish. Remember to check which lure you're using whenever you cast. Interesting. Okay, let's try the plug. Okay. Let's see what we get. I have to say, like, I'm definitely going to have to get used to this uh, fishing mechanic. It's not necessarily that I dislike it. It's so different from anything I've ever uh, played. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Ocean Angel. I think I just need to get used to the new um, controls. Perfect. Finally, a word on bait. Okay. 
Baiting your line is essential to catching larger species of fish. There are two types, low grade and high grade. If you cast with no bait, you will attract small species only. Huh. If you cast with low grade bait, you'll attract small and medium species. Finally, if you cast with high grade bait, you'll attract medium and large species. Huh. Try it now, select a lure and bait grade and cast your line again. Cool, okay. Let's do low and then we'll do like a spinner. Okay. Try this out. It's already 10 a.m. in this game. Damn. Oops. Oof. Sorry. <laughs> Got a little too excited there. There we go. A slicing tail. Ew. Excellent. Remember, that's there's a huge range of sea creatures out there, so mix up your lure, bait, and location to catch a variety. Just be aware that your bait is limited. Be careful you don't run out. Mm. Until the sea market reopens, high-grade bait is partic in particular will be in short supply. Hey. Good to know. Whoa! Stop the press! Savannah Fisher is out the house before midday? How dare you judge me on my lifestyle? Hey, Abby. You remember River? Oh. Of course! What brings you to our shabby little burg? Wait, Savannah, is that... You finally opened it? Yeah. It's a fishing journal. Taylor and I had a thing for these waters once. Yeah. In fact, I'm reviving the business. Selling street food straight from the ocean. Savannah, you are gonna... <laughs> nice. Thanks, Abby. Sorry, sorry, but in three years, you never once struck me as outdoorsy. Maybe it's time for a change. In that case, Captain Noodles, if you're gonna peddle Piscine cuisine from the most cursed cove in Canada, I insist you learn how to cook. Follow me. Okay, girl, she's a little chipper. It's a little much. Okay. Okay, Savannah, if you're selling street food, your kitchen is going to be your new best friend. To create a meal, you need three things. Raw fish, the recipe, and enough shells to cover the cost of any extra ingredients. Yeah. Collect recipe. Collected recipes will appear in your journal. When you step into the kitchen, you can browse and choose which meals you want to make. Why did I slay? Um, fish and chips. I can make fish cakes. Let's do that. Let's use my three-year-old fish. Um, I just need one. Cool. Cut. Oh. Your kitchen is always stocked with supplies, so the only ingredients you need to source are the fish. Uh -huh. Do I just have magical cupboards? Like, what is this? Okay, first go to the fridge and collect the necessary ingredients. Okay. Say less. What is this? I'm clicking N? Yeah. Now, move to the different stations around the kitchen and follow the instructions one by one. And be precise, mistakes will lower the quality of your meal and its sale value. Oh no, consequences. Gotta wash this? What the? Move A to follow the marker and rinse the ingredients. Ah. Okay, cool. I like that. That's pretty cool. Now I go to the chopping board. Interesting. Chopping. Press when the marker is in each hit zone to chop. How do I do that? What am I chop? Oh. Oh, I hit- okay. Interesting. Move A to keep the water at the correct temperature. Oh no! I don't like that it says A! Hello? <sighs> Jump top. Hold then release when the marker reaches the hit zone. Oh shh! Oven, press when the marker reaches the hit zone. This is a lot. Great, there are other stations around the kitchen, but you'll figure them out. Lord. Okay, I'm gonna go then. 
<laughs> Finally, always remember to put your cooked meals out for Ooh. sale. The storage box in your front yard will have to do for now. I'm uh, leaving fish products in a box outside. Okay. Let me give you a little... Mwah. Such a good boy. Okay. Um. Oh, right here. Okay. Um. There you go. I did it. Perfect. Here you can sell the fish you catch and the meals you cook. Fish and meals will sell gradually throughout the day, and the shells you earn will be transferred direct to your account. Hmm. Hmm. This old box isn't very appealing. You should upgrade to a proper machine. Haru Goto runs the tech shop. He'll give you a good deal. Ooh. Speaking of new people, if you're exploring the waves, you'll need to recover your trawler. Chat to Sarah at the boat shop. Mm -hmm. Finally, for information about fish species and filling in your journal, speak to Marina at the aquarium. <sighs> Savannah, you're really serious about this? No one's been out on these waters for three years since Taylor, I know. Oh. There are dozens, hundreds of strange and dangerous creatures out there. And we both know what it's like to lose someone. I'll be okay, trust me. Yeah. So, Sarah, Haru, and Marina. I'll see you soon. Get out of here, you freaking scallywag. Who are you? Hello? Ugh, my leg's gone to sleep. How do you stand up fishing all day? Okay, let's go. Oh my god, a deer! Ew! I want to be a Disney princess. Come back! Sorry, I got way too excited about that. Kids, remember to always run in the middle of the road. Okay. Are these supposed to be, like, tourists? Do we get more tourists as we, like, achieve certain things? This is so cool. Who are you? Ugh. Moongo is full of strange stories, Savannah. Try talking to people around town. I will. Thank you, random old lady. Oh! Here's somebody I'm supposed to talk to, I think. Ah, Mrs. Fisher. A very good day to you. <laughs> If you came looking for amusing nautical tales, I have none, so stop fishing! Damn. Mind your business. I thought maybe I could see, like, a map or something. Like, a bigger map. What is this? Real-time solutions. Ooh, that's cool. How do I enter? Oh, like that. Ah, Savannah, long time no see. What can I help you with? Selling fish. Fish. Yes, fish, why are you whispering? <clears throat> uh, it's just been so long since anyone sailed the bay. What are you currently using? Huh. Not much. My storefront is basically a storage box and an honor system. Oh, that's just sad. What you need is a windowed poly vent. Huh. A vending machine for seafood? Absolutely, my dad ordered a few on special import. But with half the town shut down, our three units in stock are proving tricky to shift. Tell you what, cook up and bring me a simple fish and chips. Maybe I can swing you a new customer discount on the display model. Sounds more like a cooking you lunch discount, but okay. I mean, whatever you need to do, you know? Oh, can you change? Stop, wait. Oh, love that. That's cool. Let me go the rest of the way here before I go back home to make uh, fish and chips. Hello, people. Oh my gosh. This town is in disarray, and my fishing shall save it. Duh. Oh, is this like the aquarium? Oh, no. Oh, it's the boat place. Hey, Savannah. Um, Fisher, and hello to you, Sarah. Johnson. Uh, been a while, huh? Finally come to collect your trawler? Exactly. The two cats. Seriously, I thought I was making a joke. Clearly not a very funny one. Uh, in that case, let me find your paperwork. Two cats, yes. Clogged fuel pump and the intake valve is shot. For three years of storage, you got off easy. It'll be 100 clams for the repair. You can pay once I finish the work. 100 clams, are you sure? That seems low. Yeah, don't worry, it's the least. For Taylor. Just give me a little time to finish up. I'll be in touch once the repairs are complete. Okay, cool. Ugh. I love that this dog follows me everywhere. I wish I could just have my dogs everywhere with me. Welcome, apologies, the aquarium isn't open for visitors. Oh, I'm not a tourist, I'm looking for Marina? At your service. Wait, Savannah, right? Taylor's wife? 
sailor was the soul of this place, the only sailor unfazed by all the legends. Someone who truly recognized the potential of both the aquarium and Moonglow. Potential? For what? To be famous, there are countless species out there unique to these waters. Just a handful would make the aquarium a huge tourist attraction. With a little investment, we could study the whole aquatic biome, turn this archaic town of myths and monsters into a hub of scientific progress. But when Taylor vanished, those dreams vanished too. Oh. Uh, how can I help? I'm fishing for my seafood business anyways. I could continue where Taylor left off. Wow, that would be incredible, but it's a huge undertaking. Quite simply, the aquarium needs new species, as many as you can find. The more unique creatures we house, the more new visitors will attract. Business across town would benefit, including yours. Every new species you bring will boost your sales. Great, where do I start? To begin, you must bring me three new species. Any three you can find. Oh my god. Sorry, it's like a little bubble in my throat. Wait, can I give you some now? I have some. Okay. Wait, I want to give you some stuff. Where'd she go? I have fish. Come take them. Hold on. Come back. You can't just have like a little donation box like, and just leave these fish here unattended? This is blasphemy! When does it close? You're supposed to be open! Oh my gosh. What is this? Ooh, I'm getting so distracted. Hello! Ah, Savannah, hello. Be careful near the water, eh? Girl, I am a fisherwoman with a dog. I don't need to be careful. I am fearless. Let me catch something really quick. Oh, I can't do it here. Okay. My bad. My, my bad. My bad. Let me collect some more fish. Fisheroonies here. How do I get into fishing? Hello? Oh, I can only do it in certain spots. Okay. Just want to stock up on my fish. I can make fish and ships and not get rid of the ones that I want to turn into the... There we go. A slicing tail, so I'll make it out of slicing tail, I guess. Oh, oopsie. Okay. What do I see my inventory? Yeah, I've got two of those, so I'm gonna make fish and ships out of that, I guess. I love this. This is really cool. I'm about it. Let's go home, everybody. Get to cooking. I wonder if I'm going to be cooking out of my um, house this entire time or if I have future options. Who are you? Who are you? Oh, hello. You must be the owner of that delightful yellow pup. <laughs> yeah, Waffles. He's a Nova Scotia duck tolling retriever. I actually know what those are and I love those. He likes chasing birds, barking at the front door, and rubs. <laughs> I'm Savannah, by the way. I run a small street food business. In fact, I'm looking for new customers if there's anything you'd like to try. <laughs> Absolutely, but nothing too rich or spicy. How about steamed fish? Just like they made in Malaysia. Thank you very much. What are these? Oh, she's got little doggies that follow her. <gasps> Stop. <laughs> I love that there's so many dogs in this game. You can never have enough dogs, okay? Wait, pet, 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 pet. I'm surprised, like, you don't get a Steam Achievement for all of the petting of the dogs. Let me go ahead. Oh, I have no money? I have no money? Oh, that's awkward. Okay. I guess I better make more stuff. I guess. I don't know. Trading bellyfish bling. What is this? Wait, what? Oh, whole fish, sizzling fish. How do I make steamed fish? That's what that lady wants. Okay, steamed. There it is. Any fish seasoning. Why can't I make this yet? Ah. Okay. I guess I'll just make a bunch of stuff then. 
Let's go ahead and make another one. I want to get better at this, so... So I've just got to follow this little thingy -ma bob. Okay, I got that in the green. This one, I don't remember. Oh, shit! Ah! Ah! That got me stressed out. Okay, this one was, like, particularly weird. Oh, this is so strange. This is, like, made for, like, a controller or something. Because, like, gosh darn it. Okay, I got that one right this time. Okay. I did much better this time. Did I get stressed? Of course, but it is what it is. Let's cook something else. Um, let's do a whole fish, I guess. Hell yeah. Let's do it. Let's go. Okay, I gotta get my fish. This one's much easier. And then let's wash her. She's gorgeous. We love her. Is this easier? Because I'm just like plopping a whole fish in the oven. Oh, we're frying it. Okay. Oh, I burned it! No! Okay. I think hot fried fish. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay. I'm with it. I'm about it. I'm all for it, I guess. These controls are so strange. Ugh. This is definitely probably fantastic on Switch though, which they have it on Switch. Which I think it was like a recent release that they um did that. They fry it. Because I believe this game's actually been out for a while. Um, but then they were doing, like, um, some promotion for the new stuff that came out for, uh, Switch. Um, okay, that one's a little bit better. It's not as rough. Let's just cook everything, I guess. Screw it. Let's go. Let's take it. There we go. I'm big braining so hard right now. <laughs> okay. See, I'm slowly getting the hang of it. It's just like working out the kinks in some of this. Except for that like one mechanic. I think it's the boiling mechanic. This one was not made for... Oh my god, what am I supposed to do? That's hard, okay. Okay, this time I didn't burn it. Look, I'm doing better, guys. I promise. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and put all this out on the um, box out there and hope we get some cash money. There you go. Cool. Raccoon, hello! So many furry friends to have, okay? And I'm about it. I really am. Look at all this trash. What the heck, bro? Where can I go fishing? Where's the little fishing side of that? Here it is. Let's go ahead and do a plague blow bait. Let's see what we got going on here. I wonder if you're more likely to catch certain fish at night too. Probably, because a lot of games have those types of mechanics. Um, so I feel like that would be pretty neat. There we go. Caught another ling. Go ahead and go again. I 
actually love this game. It's so cute. Ooh, a child of the moon. Oh, the mi Okay, cool. Looks almost like serpentile. But yeah, sorry. As I was talking about when we were cooking, um, so I guess that they released it to Switch. I don't know if they've released it to other platforms too, like maybe Xbox or something like that. Um, who is that person in the background? Uh, let's go ahead and change up my beat, I guess. Oops. Let's change this up a little bit. Let's try, um, a jig with some low quality and let's see what we catch there. This is so cool. But yeah, I'm just absolutely obsessed with fishing in games like Stardew, any sort of cozy game. Um, like Dinkum, I really like fishing in. What else has fishing in it? I know I've played a lot that has it in there. I don't know, I'm drawing a blank, but... Oh, I think Palea has some. Slicing tail. Okay, I'm like recouping everything, which is good. Okay, I should probably go to bed. I should probably go to bed. I am an older woman. And my bones will probably hurt. Oh, girl. Okay. Sorry. Bestie's having a moment. She's partying. Partying on the beach. Okay. What is this supposed to be? Hello? Abby's scraps. Whatever floats your boat. Ha ha ha. Dear! Okay. Hello, bestie! I love you! I like how he just pops into existence. Okay, time to go to bed, my doggy dog. Come on. Look at the bed with the little... <laughs> That's so cute. Let's set the alarm for morning. Stop, this is so cute. I like this a lot. I love this. I think we're gonna end it here and we'll probably be checking out this game in the future if you guys like it. Uh, please let me know if you enjoyed this game because I'm actually really, really enjoying this. The controls are a little weird, to be honest, but I know I was looking through the Steam reviews and other people had that complaint, so hopefully the developer is going to fix that. Um, if they can, sometimes it can be a little bit tricky and I understand that. But this was Moon Glow Bay and I love it and I love all the dogs. That's what sold it for me. Um, and I'll definitely be checking more of this out. Um, but yeah, if you guys enjoyed this, please make sure to like and subscribe. I really appreciate it and I will see you in the next one. Bye!